In today's video, I want to show you how you can redirect a Squarespace form to a thank you page. And I'll show you how to do this in Squarespace 7.0 and in Squarespace 7.1. The reason why you'd want to do this is if somebody fills out your email sign-up form, you'd want to redirect them to a thank you page that basically encourages them to stay longer on your website or invites them to join your community or just gives them instructions on what to do next and what's going to happen now. So basically, that's the primary reason why you'd want to do this. You can use it for newsletter sign-up forms, like what we have right here, or you can even use it for like when somebody fills out a contact form or any other type of form on your page. The method is basically the same, no matter which form you use. So let's start with 7.1. So basically what I have right here is a cover page that I created in 7.1 and once they click on this button it pops up a newsletter form that once they fill out will get redirected to this thank you page and then invites them to read the blog or check out the services. So of course this will depend on the type of business you have and what you want them to do but you get the general idea. So the first thing you need to do is obviously create the thank you page and the page that has your form. And once that once you have those two pages in place, what you'll want to do is go to this thank you page and then click on the settings icon and you'll go under general and then you'll copy this URL slug. So we're going to click command copy and then you're going to go back and click on close. Now you're going to back to your freebie sign up page or whatever page has the newsletter form that or any other type of form that you want to redirect. So I'm going to click on edit custom form and then edit newsletter sign up and under advanced under this post submit redirect basically you're going to click and add the URL which is basically you're just going to copy the slug for your thank you page and you can even click on content and then select it from the drop down menu here or the options that pop up here. And then once you have that, you're going to click on save and then click back. And now whenever somebody fills out this form, they will get redirected to this thank you page. Uh, another thing that you can do in 7.1, so let's click on the home page. And again, I have here a section with an email sign up form. And if I click on edit, and then here for the newsletter form, I can click on edit. And the same thing happens under post submit over here. We're going to click on this tab and under post submit redirect, click to add URL forward slash and then paste the URL slug for your thank you page or simply select it from this content menu up here. And then you click apply, save, and that's basically it. And you can do the same for your contact form. So basically, if we go to the contact page and we click on edit and then we click on this form, click on the advanced tab and under post submit redirect forward slash paste the URL for your thank you page and then click on apply. Let's add the storage for this and let's go, I don't know, demo at demo.com because this is just a demo site. So we click on apply and then click on save and now whenever somebody fills out this form they will get redirected to that thank you page basically this thank you page over here and the same thing applies for 7.1 literally the process is the same there's uh, nothing special about it you go to the page you'll have to have your thank you page created of course like what we have right here and include whatever it is that you want to include on your thank you page. And then you're going to click on edit here under the settings for that particular page. You're going to come over here to general, copy the URL slug, click on back, close, and then click done. And then you're going to go under for on the page that has the form that you want to redirect. You're going to click on the edit or on the pencil icon to, ed to edit the form. And under post submit, you're going to go to post submit redirect and again paste the URL slug, click apply, done, hover over done and click on save changes. And that's basically it. It works the same way for any other form that you have on your 
Squarespace 7.1 website, even for the regular contact forms that are there. And that's it for today's video. If you liked it, I would appreciate it if you give me a thumbs up so I know to create more videos like this and consider subscribing to my channel. I publish new videos every Thursday. And if you're in the process of creating your own website, I do have a free roadmap that you can use that walks you through the entire process. And you can access that by going to ladesignstudio.com forward slash free. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.